Hey everyone, welcome to my After Effects tutorial. Today we're going to create trending 3D product animation techniques in After Effects. Open After Effects. Go to the project panel. Create a new composition. Change comp name to render. Preset custom, width 1920. Height 1080 pixels. Duration time 15 seconds. And click OK. Make sure to well organize your project panel as I am showing. In this video, we're going to work with this folder called Tutorial. Again, create a new comp. Change comp name to BG. And make a comp size. And click OK. We need to create background. Right click, New, Solid, Go to the Effect Presets, search for the Gradient Ramp, drag and drop on the BG layer. I'm going to create beautiful looking sky blue background. Change Ramp Scatter Amount to 250. Also change the Ramp Shape, Linear to Radial Ramp, and change the End Color to Sky Blue. Again, select the start color. Change the color to Caribbean green. Open Render Comp. Drag and drop the BG Comp to render composition. We need to create three image and assets comp. Again, create a new composition. Change comp name to Cadbury Oreo. Width 800, height 800, and click OK. Again, create a new composition. Change name to Cadbury Fruit and Nut. Make comp same size and click OK. And again, create a new comp. Change name to Cadbury Bubbly. Make comp size and click OK. You can see now we have created three comps. Select the Cadbury Oreo. Go to the project panel search for the Cadbury PNG image. Drag and drop on the timeline. Press S to open scale property. Adjust the scale value as shown. Again, search for the Milk Splash PNG image. Drag and drop on the timeline. Adjust the scale and rotation value as shown. Again, select the Fruit and Nut. Go to the Project panel. Search for the image called Cadbury Fruit and Nut. Drag and drop the image. Adjust the scale value. You have to do same process to other comp also. And now select the render comp. Go to the project panel. Select all three Cadbury comps. Drag and drop on the timeline. I want give some rotation to all Cadbury images. Now we need to create 3D animation. Right click camera. Keep camera default settings. And click OK. Again, right-click New Null Object. Rename the Null Object to Position. Duplicate the Null Layer. Change the name to Wiggle. 
to animate. We need to parent the link. If you don't find the parent link, press F4 to open and close. Select the camera and parent to the position and wiggle layer. Select the wiggle layer. Press P to open position. Hold Alt and click on the stopwatch icon and type wiggle close bracket 1.4 comma close bracket. As you can see now, there is no movement on the Cadbury images. I forgot to enable the 3D. Enable the 3D icon on here to position, wiggle, and other three Cadbury images. Now you can see it wiggling. Select the position layer. Press P to open position property. Go to the composer view and change one view to two view. Now you have to change position of X and Y. Select the Cadbury second image. Pull up the Z amount as shown. Same, you have to change the position to other Cadbury layer also. Now go to the first frame. Select the Postion layer. Press PE on your keyboard. Click on the stopwatch icon to create a keyframe. Go to 15 frames and move the keyframe. And change the position value as shown. And make sure to click the motion blur to all layer except the BG layer. Select all keyframes. Press F9 to easy ease. Open graph editor and change the graph something like this. Press space bar to preview. Go at 2 second. Click the keyframe. Again go at 3 second. And change the X, Y, Z position value as shown. Again, go at 4 second. Click the keyframe. Go at 5 second. And change the X, Y, Z position value as shown. Press space bar button to preview. It seemed that Cadbury image is only wiggling. I want to wiggle the other assets also. To do that, go to the Cadbury Oreo. Select the image. Press PA to open position. Hold Alt and click at the stopwatch icon and type wiggle open bracket. One dot, four comma, five and close bracket. Copy the expression and paste through the other image and change view setting as shown. Make sure to give same expression to the other images also. Now we have to give the text animation. Select Cadbury Oreo Comp. Type Oreo. I am using Rubber Duck font. You can download the font from 
dayfont.com. Change the position and rotation something like this. Now we have to animate the text layer. If you don't have Animation Composer, then you have to visit mrhorse.com and download the free plugin. I have given the download link on my description. Now you have to create a new text on the Cadbury Fruit and Nuts comp. Change the position and rotation something like this. Press P to open the position. Give a keyframe and animate as shown. Again, go to the third Cadbury Bubbly Comp and create a new text as shown. Press space button to preview. Finally, we have created the trending 3D product animation. I hope you all love this video. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned. Thank you.